What's up guys, Violet here, and today what we're going to be looking at is the long-awaited next episode of Mythbusters. Can I just say a big thank you to everyone that watched and liked the last Mythbusters episode? It's currently sitting at 42k views and 1,593 likes. It's safe to say that you guys really enjoy the Mythbusters series. So if this video can get 500 likes, that'd be absolutely amazing. And let's get right into today's Mythbusters then. Like I said, this episode has been long-awaited. And uh, I'm going to get these out more frequently. It's just because Rise of Iron has come out. And I've been doing so much stuff with that. I haven't had time to make Mythbusters. But I finally got together with some friends and started to do some myths. So let's look at them today then. I just, I can't thank you guys enough for the support on the last video from Mythbusters. This is absolutely crazy. But with all that jibber jabber out of the way, let's get into the first myth then. So Pitman The, or is it Plitman The? I'm actually reading these off the computer. If I get your names wrong, I'm really sorry. I'll put them up on screen anyway. He wants to know... If you shoot a Nova Bomb, will it explode? And this one was quite interesting. I tried many times shooting a Nova Bomb. It was hard to hit. But there was one time where I actually blatantly sniped it and it did not explode. So we'll have a look at it and then uh, you can decide as well if you want to. So here's the clip. Okay, so that was a clip, and as I said, I blatantly shot it. I guess you could say I shot it, and it didn't explode. I think bullets just go straight through it, and I think that one is uh, myth busted in terms of that, and that's just a false myth. You can't explode another bomb while shooting it. So let's move on to the next one, then. It's actually from Jew Dude, um, and he asks, can Thorn two-shot with final round? Now, this one is interesting. I'm going to play the clip, and then I'm going to speak about it after. So let's look at the clip. So as you can see from that clip, you can only two shot with the thorn with final round if you get two headshots. It has to be two headshots and the burn will actually kill you, not um, the two shots itself. The final round shot won't kill you, the burn will kill you. So if you're lucky enough in Crucible, you've got two bullets left and shoot someone in the head twice with the thorn and you're on the final round, you will get the burn kill. But if you shoot them in the body twice as i'm going to show you here the it just doesn't work the burn doesn't kill you either you don't die so uh, i guess you can two shot people with final round with a thorn but only with two headshots the next one is from population control and he asks if stuck by a grenade will passing through an allied bubble pull it off of you and allied means like teammate bubble will it pull it off of you so we actually tested that i'll show you the gameplay here and then we'll talk about it <laughs> Okay, so as you can see, it doesn't actually pull the grenade off you. But if your teammate has a blessing of light bubble, it actually protects the teammate. So it kind of does pull it off you in a sense of um, helping you and you can survive the grenade. But pulling it off you in the sense of passing through and the grenade just drops on the floor after going through the bubble. No, that doesn't work. So in terms of his comment, no, it doesn't work. But it will protect you if you do have a blessing of light bubble. The next one is from Alpha Wolf. And he asks, can you shoot a grenade out of the air? And I know a lot of people probably do know this answer, but I'm going to be putting myths in these videos that some people may or may not know simply because people comment it and they really want to know. So I want to answer you guys. So let's take a look at the gameplay and we will soon find out. As you can see, yes, you can shoot a grenade out of the air, but I believe it is limited to only certain grenades, like the trip mine grenades, uh, the Titan shot grenade, etc. Like that, the ones that can actually stick to things are the ones that you can shoot out of the air. I believe the other ones, uh, I think some of them you can, but um, some of them, like the Warlock Stun Seal grenades, I don't believe you can actually shoot them out of the sky. So this was quite a tricky one. We tested it with many grenades, and this was a grenade I was actually only able to hit. So you can shoot a grenade out of the air. It didn't uh, specify which exact good grenade he wanted to see but to answer his question yes you can shoot a grenade out of the air and i believe actually no that isn't the last one i just checked and we're actually on the last one here it's from underage gamer big shout out to underage gamer uh he's actually always in my streams etc he's a really really cool dude but anyway he asks myth can you be tethered and walk normally whilst wearing the radiant dance machines for the hunter and i thought this was really interesting and really really wanted to try it out so as you can see in the gameplay here i use radiant i don't use radiant dance machines and i get tethered and i'm walking very very slow and now i'm going to play the clip where i'm actually wearing radiant dance machines and you will see
So as you can see there, it does not affect you. Radiant Dance Machines won't give you that cheeky little boost while being tethered. It doesn't work. So yeah, they were the five myths for this Mythbusters episode. Like I said, I'm really sorry about this being so long. It's been long awaited. You guys are really, really enjoying the Mythbusters episode. So thank you so much for that. And if we can go for that almighty 500 likes, you guys are insane. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Comment down below any other myths you guys would like to see. Try and comment one we haven't done before. And also subscribe if you're new around here for some more Destiny content. Rolling around Rise of Iron, myths, etc. If you just want to see more Destiny content, hit that subscribe button. My name has been Violet and I'll see you all on the next video. And again, thank you for the amount of support on the last Mythbusters episode. See you later, chaps.